it's not about me. When I was working with the Muncie Anna Volleyball Club, which is one of the better clubs in our country, you'd have all these guys and, and mostly guys that were coming out of Ball State and out of the university there. Um, it was all about how well they could do. And as you, as you mature as a coach, you realize it's not about you. It's about developing players and developing people. And, and here I am now I've been coaching for about 44 years and it, you know, it's absolutely all about the athletes. And you know, sometimes I have to remind people on my support staff that because they, they get upset maybe because of whatever. And I say, we're not here if it's not for those 17 players. We're not at Purdue. We don't have a job if it isn't for the student athletes. And I've always felt like I was coaching and teaching for the right reasons. But the competitive juices sometimes takes coaches and makes them feel it's all about how many matches they win or how many championships that they can win. And what do they look like to the crowd that's there at those particular matches? And so as you get older, you get over that and young people, the sooner you do get over that, the better coach you're going to be and the better teacher of the game and the better mentor you'll be. If you don't worry about those types of things, just do your job and uh, you can learn more from the players sometimes than anybody else. And you need to listen more to players. And again, I didn't do a lot of that when I was young. I do a lot of it now. And you know, this is a relationship business. If you're coaching at the college level, these are grown women. They want to be respected and they want to have relationship. And if they feel like there's a trust factor between you, you're going to get so much more out of them and their experience is going to be so much better. So I think understanding that what we're doing is to try to develop people develop in our case, young women to be able to go out, whether it's to go like Andy Drews and play on the USA Olympic team and win the first gold medal. Super. If it's going to go be the best nurse you can be in the Indianapolis hospital system. Great. But our job is just to get them to where they can have a great career and they can love life the way that we do.